So we have a plan of all of us to getting together and sitting in one room and cheering for Team India. Before we go, we are also getting warmed up for the game today while practicing and making sure that we support Team India in all of our hearts. So how badly Pakistan will lose today? So what do you expect? I, mean, I don't want them to lose very badly. I want it to be a close match so that there's excitement. But uh, in the end, in last four or five overs, I think India will dominate and they'll get the win. So previous uh, in T20, India was a step down. Uh, it was a little step down, but if you look at the squad right now, it's totally packed. Everybody is in form, batsmen, bowlers, and they're fielding well. So I think it's going to be really tough for Pakistan today. So what do you say? What are you expecting in today's match? Uh, it's a close encounter, high voltage, as you said. Uh, it will be a close game. I think India has the edge, and it will be entertaining for sure. Everybody will enjoy. So about yourself? Uh, me, I'm, I'm a normal cricketer, just trying to Your make name, it. Sir? My name, Anurup. Anurup. Okay, thank you. Obviously, when it comes to India versus Pakistan, obviously be a high voltage match. Excited to see what the outcome is. So, which players are you expecting today? There will be a great show today from this. Obviously, Kohli, that's an obvious pick in any India versus Pakistan game. And then I hope to see some uh, good swing from Shahid Afridi. And then I guess. So, some cricketers are saying Bobber will. Uh, will give a good movement today. So what do you expect? Nah, nah, nah. With Bumran the lineup, I don't think that'll happen anytime soon. So what are you expecting from today's match? It will be any close encounter or it will be a Pakistan league? See, it might be a close encounter, but India for sure. They'll win for sure. So about you, sir? I'm Tilak. I'm a, a, a fast bowling all-rounder. Thank you. So especially India versus Pakistan. India versus Pakistan as a game has been always looked forward to. Uh, it's the biggest rivalry in the cricket that we have been watching ever since we have grown up playing this game. Uh, it's wonderful to see great cricketers taking on and uh, playing for the country. The excitement, uh, we're, we're looking for a very nail-biting finish, not a one-sided game. We want a good contest today and uh, we definitely want India to be on top and win the game. Which player are you expecting he's make a very good movement today? Uh, from the form that I have been watching for the cricket, uh, for the Indian players, I think uh, Rohit is in good form. Definitely he has scored a century last match. Uh, Virat is definitely in a good form as well because he's been consistently scoring runs. And one, one player that I think will make a big difference today is Shreya Sayer. Uh, he got a good century during Asia Cup, but he's yet to fire in uh, the World Cup. So I think it's, it's Shreya Sayer's day today. When this comes to the opponent team, uh, Babar and some bowlers are very good in the note. They are in the top list, in a very good batting. So, what are you expecting from them? So, Indian bowlers will... Uh... I think the kind of form that Indian bowlers are in currently, uh, it's pretty difficult to play them. Uh, the reason being, Bumrah has been bowling at 140 plus consistently with, with great swing. Plus, the kind of bowling Siraj is doing at present, is in full form, full confidence and... Uh, I think it will be very difficult for Pakistani players to score runs against Indians. However, having said that, uh, Pakistan players are also really good at the top, uh, especially Babar Azam and uh, Rizwan is in good form. Scored a brilliant century against uh, the other team the other day. Uh, Ashwak Shafiq has been really good recently and I, I think it will be a good contest, very good contest today. My name is Tazim uh, and I play for different clubs, uh, division level cricket. And, uh, and it's always been fun to watch India-Pakistan cricket. Thank you. Thank you. So, I mean, it's needless to say, you can expect uh, a very nail-biting finish. You can expect sparks flying all around the ground. You can, uh, 130,000 people booing for, you know, Pakistan and chanting for India. <coughs> it says a lot, especially the current, uh, current form that we have been in. Uh, all the players clicking in at the right time, Rohit Sharma picking up at the right time. Shreya Shire, I know he has an issue with the short ball, but he has been able to consistently score at international cricket. That means that he knows how to tackle the balls. <laughs> right. So, from... So you say about the Babar and other batsmen who are very good in the top list especially. So, how the Indian bowlers will make them perform? See, with uh, Fakhar going out and uh, Abdullah Shafiq coming in, he is a very compact player, he is technically sound and he can play the big shots as well. Imam, on the other hand, is a more con conservative player. He does not believe in hit and success. He plays all around the ground, but still maintains a strike rate of almost 90 plus and average of 54 plus. So that speaks about a lot. They have quality and they consistently score runs, right? 
So plus Pakistan, the way they play, they are unpredictable. On any given day, the other day, you would not have given them a chance to score 345 even against Sri Lanka, but they scored that. And today, might they, they might well roll out under 90. So that's the kind of uh, dynamics that they have in the team. But uh, we are looking forward to it. And hopefully, uh, India, if they bowl well, they can restrict Pakistan to a decent score and then chase down some, by a significant margin to up the net run rate. So if India won the turns, what will which decision will be the better for the team? So I, I would suggest, from my experience, uh, from watching what happens at Narendra Modi Stadium, I, I would suggest uh, you bowl first, because when the dew comes on later in the night under the light, uh, so uh, you know the ball skids on a little better. In the first half of the game, you can expect the pitch to be a little slower, as we witnessed during India Australia match, which is which was very docile in nature, and that has how been, you know, Ahmedabad's pitch. So that is the. Uh, uh, mantra that I am looking forward to win the toss, bowl first uh, and then put uh, Pakistan under pressure even uh, considering the fact that Shaheen Afridi is not cranking up as he used to he is consistently, his pace is dipped to some around uh, 80 to 83 miles which is almost 7 miles lesser than his normal speed. Hassan Ali he has come back in but he was out of favour for a very long time so uh, yeah, you, if you can put the Pakistan batsmen uh, pr under pressure early in the innings, then you can expect uh, India to roll coast. Sir, today is the weekend. How your team is preparing towards the match? Oh, we are all geared up. Uh, I mean, uh, we are just, uh, through this session, what we are trying to do is that, uh, you know, energize us, ourselves so that when we start watching the match, we, we are absolutely relieved. Uh, you know, we know what to expect from this game. We are just pumping ourselves through this game. So, otherwise, we would not have come to ground to play today. So, that was the objective. Thank you, Sorry? Partha.